Hey there, it's Diane Banks, voice actress, radio personality in Chicago. Here's my most popular uploads for you. I hope you'll take a look at some of the ones you haven't seen yet. Please take a second to subscribe if you haven't yet. Uh, showing you a cupcake there a little early. <laughs> but I would appreciate it if you would subscribe and ask your friends to subscribe if they haven't yet too. Let's take a peek at today's topic. We're going to get right to it. Vanellope Sweets. The adorable new sweets shop on the Disney Dream. They've given us some fun facts from the Disney Parks blog. Um, so let's take a look at some of the things they had to say. When you first enter the space from the outside deck, there's a mural of the starting line from the game, a sculpture of Vanellope's racing cart, and a sculpture of King Candy waving the checker checkered flag from the winner's podium. The racetrack circles the entire space, which we'll look at. But here's a nice shot of the mural in the background there when you first come in the door. Here's our King Candy with his little racing flag and the adorable car with his family enjoying their Sunday, which we're going to take a closer peek at that yumminess Sunday as well. Now the mural behind the sculpture of Vanellope is called the Candy Cane Forest. It's where Wreck-It Ralph first met Vanellope, of course, in the film. So of course they would have that in the restaurant. Um, there she is doing her goofy upside down hanging in the shop. How fun this would be though to, to see that on the cruise. Brand new. Here's some of that racing track around there and then um, we'll talk about these speakers going on here more in just a second. I think that was the last of those shots there. But um, this here is a nice way to see along here with the racetrack. Here we have the finish line. You can see that there and there he is with the, the starting flag over here. There's Vanellope. And these are gas pumps. Aren't they cute? Where some of the candy is stored. I love these candy lights on the ceiling and just the details are really adorable. So we'll continue with our fun facts here. See what else they had to share with us. Uh, keeping with the video game racing and candy theme, the background music in the shop, it's a combo of music from the film, 8-bit video game music, and J-pop. I love that. The animated leaderboard, it's a replica from the film. We're going to take a look at the leaderboard in just a second, which is pretty cool. The grandstands on top of the candy dispensers, exact replicas from the film. Each one represents a racer in the game. So they have their own. Sour Bill, which we're going to meet now, he's an animated figure. He appears in the center gas pump so he's in here uh, in the style gumball dispenser he sleeps occasionally wakes up to say something sour he's voiced by rich moore the director he recorded new lines of dialogue just exclusively for vanellope sweets and treats shop and we got some uh treat recipes to look at too but here he is in the shop despite what everyone thinks i am not a cough drop <laughs> Oh, please wash your hands. Thank you. <laughs> Reminding us to wash our hands, and here's another of his little comments that he has to say. Whoops. Maybe he would be happier if he had some ice cream, huh? <laughs> um, okay, so here's some cute photos from the shop itself. These are from the Disney Cruise Line blog. I just found out they have a blog, too. But look at how cute that is when you first walk into the door. Here's a nice close-up on her car sculpture that you can sit at and have your ice cream. Beautiful shot of the mural that we just talked about. There's the kids in the race cars. Here's our King Candy. Um, and yeah, so this is um, the yummy menu. We'll take a look at Vanellope Sunday here in a second too. But look at that. It's 13 bucks, but you get three scoops of ice cream, five toppings. The Vanellope, uh, the race challenge, Ralph's family challenge is 20 bucks, but it's a big, big uh, cup, souvenir trophy cup, which we'll look at too, and then King Candy and so on. But just thought it would be fun for us to see some of the price range there. A little cute stir enjoying her candy. And look from Monsters, Inc., our little buddy showing up there in the shop as well. Um, so they have some other shots for us here. There's Vanellope hanging up. Yeah, here's the cool thing I wanted to show you about the leaderboard that they talk about. Um, it's trending ice cream. So whatever's trending for the day, whoever's ordering the most of Sundays, they rotate. And so number one right now would be King Candy, Ralph's Family Challenge, and number two, Wreck-It Ralph Race for the Sundays, and so forth. Vanellope's Cute Go-Kart Sunday is in sixth place, but again, they rotate during the day. And there we saw um, on the menu, you know, what the different prices and things were 
for each of the Sundays. Uh, but I just thought that was kind of neat that they tell us that too. Here we see the big close-up of the candy cup. So if you guys ordered this for 20 bucks for your family, that's a big thing of ice cream with like eight or nine scoops. Here's her little car and they have another uh, close-up of that. This would be a cute take home, wouldn't it? The souvenir there. It's like 13 bucks, but again, you can share it with your family. And, um, and then there's some nice shots of the restaurant or the ice cream shop, all the yummy gelato flavors and so forth. Um, let me see if there was anything else on here I wanted to show you before we move on. But it was just a neat way to uh, take a peek since we aren't there, uh, at least not yet. Here's some recipes, the Oreo cookies from the Vanilla Pea Sweets and Treats. So you would find these there. You can make these at home. I'll put the recipe link in the video uh, under the video for you. And then the Wreck-It Ralph bars, peanut butter blondies from the Sweets and Treats shop. Isn't that cute with the little candy of Wreck-It Ralph, his face on top of there too. So some yummy sweets and recipes. We got some great pics from inside and some fun facts to go along with it uh, about design and voiceovers and all. What would be your favorite thing uh, that you would want to go there? And do you like the idea of going on a Disney cruise and seeing the Vanellope shop? Or do you prefer the online um treats and eats and such instead. I, I would think that it would be a ton of fun to go on there and um, and get one of these. Here's Sunday. I think this would be my pick. Let me know what your Sunday pick would be, but this with all the yummy scoops, beautiful, and you get to take home the car. So let me know your thoughts in the comments. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you have great holidays too. Thanks for watching. It's Diane Banks. Please subscribe. Take care. I'll talk to you soon.